hey what's up guys welcome back let's get into it so y'all let's talk about it today um this is going to be a quick little video just to make awareness of coupon fraud now i actually have a uh know somebody that was doing it um and they I i'll tell you about it all right so this lady is facing 12 years um in prison for coupon fraud y'all do y'all see this the bank records indicates that she made it was her and her husband um there was a little duo doing this um and y'all she made almost four hundred thousand dollars from it so basically she was making the coupons and selling them and i you know i'm gonna show you some comments um you can let you can let me know what you think but i'm not convinced that these people just didn't know or didn't well maybe maybe so maybe so because i'm gonna tell you why so here's some of the comments and look at the comments y'all it's a company some people almost agree that they're okay with her you know doing this or with people doing this um it's a company should stop printing 25 cents off coupons for an item that costs $17.99 and this wouldn't exist. Are you serious, lady? And it is a lady. I just kind of uh, scribble her name and stuff. You cannot be serious. I mean, I don't care what they, I don't care if it's 10 cents off. You know, just like we use Ibotta. We use Ibotta and guess what? Sometimes it's like 10 cents off. Um, but if you need that product, you're going to buy it, you know? wow y'all okay so somebody else said did she get to keep the money she made off selling coupons well yeah she did um her bank statement basically said she made about four hundred thousand dollars which that's a lot of money you know um that's years and years and years uh people who you know work in factories uh people who just work hard for their money period that's a lot of money um and she didn't make it the right way um bet her lawyer fee was high of course now somebody said now let's go after the billionaire that steals 10 times that i get the third degree when i use my coupon and a lot of rules come with them so the next move would be to stop coupons yeah it's it, uh, coupons have definitely changed over the years now back in the day when i hear a lot of people saying how sweet it was to coupon i wasn't that person i only been couponing maybe four years maybe um but anyway so here's some more y'all um someone that does manslaughter gets less time than this our system is so messed up um yes and the thing is to be honest i mean i don't want to say but technically she most likely she will not get 12 years y'all but that's just what she is facing i doubt if she gets that however i will say disclaimer this is just my opinion okay um somebody said she better hope she had 60% off prison sentence. Lord have mercy. I almost laughed, but it, the situation is not funny, okay? Um, somebody said, I better check my coupons. And this is the one I really wanted to read um, because I know a lot of people are going to say, how do you not know? Well, if you're new in the game and you just don't know, you just don't know, okay? Somebody said they better check their coupons because I use a lot of them. But most of them are on my cell phone. Also, oh, she's probably okay. Um, and she also said, now let's go after the billionaire that's still 10 times dead. Oh, maybe that's the same comment, but yeah, that is the same comment. So anyway, this is what I want to say, y'all. I just want to bring awareness to it because honestly, y'all, it, there are some people that just, they don't know. They don't know. Um, I had a client I used to do hair. I know some of you guys already know, but I used to do hair and I had a client who, um, came to me faithfully and she got into using coupons so one day we was just talking and i'm telling you when my clients were i always got really close to my clients um but she was telling me that she told me the girl's name i know exactly who you know she um was who she is that's making them because I don't, I don't know if she's still making them i will say that um but i did let her know you're not getting ten dollars off pampers you're not getting five dollars off laundry soap you know seven dollars laundry soap 
So then she, you know, telling me, and I, and I really believe she did not know. Um, I was like, you know, it's a lot of fraud out there with the coupons. But then she told me the only thing she has to do is a certain type of paper because apparently her and the girl was really close. She said she go over the girl's house and she just got stuff everywhere. Do you hear me? She was racking up with stuff. And um, so the lady, she enjoyed couponing because she just thought she was doing everything right. Believe it or not, even when I told her, I was like, those are fake coupons. And you can get in a lot of trouble for that. Um, she didn't believe me. She really thought that this was, this is what, this is couponing. This is the couponing life. I'm a real couponer. No, you're a fraud couponer and you don't even know. And this is how I know she didn't know because she told me it's a certain, she said, yeah, because all I have to do is get a certain, buy a certain kind of paper for her to use. Okay. So when did Kimberly Clark give you permission to make her coupons. Who signed you? When you start working for Kimberly Clark? You know? So, yeah. So, she was... I mean, they just thought that was the coupon life. When, you know, the real couponers... You know, we go through a lot with these coupons. You know, um, it's just not that easy. So, did I report it? No, I did not. Um, but I did tell her, I let her know now that what she did with the information I told her that is on her. I don't care what nobody say. Don't be in the comments. Tell me, you should have. No, I shouldn't have. Cause I'm just not about that life. Um, but I did let her know. So hopefully she took that information and she ran with it because she really didn't know. Like she didn't know that there was fraud. She just thought she was, you know. The new age couponer. But anyway, y'all. So, um, make sure if you are getting coupons. Y'all, they don't have high value coupons like that. I mean, every now and then. Yeah, you will get a $5 coupon off something. That. Or, like, the medicine that. Uh, what is it? The gummies. Uh, sometimes you'll get a $4 coupon. And, you know, that's, that's legit. If it's coming in the Sunday paper. It's legit. You know what I'm saying? If you getting them from somebody, there are coupon fairies, okay? So don't let me don't let me twist my words around. But if it doesn't if it doesn't look right, you know you ain't getting no five dollars off no darn tide in the tide four ninety seven. But anyway, y'all, let me let me get out of here. Peace out.